Okay, so this is a breakdown for um, compositing multi-channel renders. Uh, here we have the creature. I unpack the discrete passes, uh, lighting passes, from the XR file via Pro EXR. Did it manually, so I know how to do it manually, but I also use this, which is far easier. So, um, unpack these, got the original on the bottom, hidden by the color. I have tweaked both its hue and saturation and its curves, pulling down the red in particular, uh, because there was a lot of red to clean his, in, his, in his torso, so that we can pull up some of that green. Um, moving on to the diffuse, uh, lighten and darken, similar kind of story, basically just match these as best I could. Um, the same thing with lighten on the top, and then we move on to ambient occlusion, I should. Yes, I've dropped the opacity and ambient occlusion by 80%. I uh, haven't applied any other discrete effects to the layer. Specular, I have applied discrete effects, so I've pulled a lot of the red and a lot of the blue out of the specular layer. Um, because I figure if this environment is green, that perhaps he's on some alien planet where there's like a green sun, if such a thing exists. But, you know, he's an alien, so it's all fairly fictional for now. Um, shadow, haven't really done much with the shadow. Could have darkened it a little more. Um, lighting, not much has been done with the lighting, but direct irradiance, we see a similar kind of thing as what I was trying to do with the specular um, and with the base color. Just pulling a lot of that red and blue out so they kind of is absorbing the light that is in his environment. Um, and that's about all. I've also, just out of interest, uh, and I'll be including this in the in the submission, uh, attempted to do the same thing with one of my own renders, if it ever loads, there we go. Uh, and in this case we have EXR, but they're kind of, they're moving around, you know, so I have about 30 frames of just a very gradual rotation camera shot on a crate sitting on a table. And the trick with this one, I suppose, was to try and make the woods and the overall kind of look of the crate look the same. Um, as the table, so this is what the original looked like, it's much redder, yeah. Um, so yeah, that's about it, thank you very much.